to the vlog. Today is Wednesday and you could definitely say I had a weekend and I'm still trying to like get my voice back from that. I think I lost it maybe Sunday and today is Wednesday so it's slightly concerning but it doesn't hurt so it's totally fine. I have one meeting today but I'm not leading the meeting so I really don't need to worry about talking much. I do need to be on campus today around 1.30, hence the robe because I just feel like why well, get dressed when I'm gonna have to get undressed and redressed again? Other than that, I'm feeling like today's just gonna be a typical day. You know, I do have some stuff that I need to catch up on. Like I have this gigantic pile of receipts that I need to go through and update my expenses from the weekend. And then what else? I think I still have a couple of clothes that I need to put away and I need to sort out food at some point. I need to kind of like get my life back. You know what I mean? Like it's always when you go out of town and you come back even if it's just two or three days, it just feels like stuff is all out of place. So that's what my goal is gonna to be today. I do have several emails in this inbox that need to be flipped through to determine whether or not there are even any of my business. So I'm gonna get started with that and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. I got 10 minutes. I think this is gonna do for today. Let's ride. I'm definitely late, but it's fine. It's fine. We go and do this. Let me get my purse. And I brought a jean jacket because I don't think I feel 100% comfortable out here in my tank top. But if I see others have their tank top on, oh, best believe this jacket's coming off because it's like 80 degrees today. Hold up, cause girls is players too. I truly feel like I have not said much to y'all today. I'm so sorry. After I went to the campus, like I stuck around there for a while, had a good time, and then went to go grab some food with some coworkers, which was really good by the way. But now that I'm home, I saw that I had missed a ping and it looks like some of the audit stuff that I was working on earlier, they've changed a due date which is crazy. So it looks like something that was due tomorrow was now all of a sudden due, what, Monday? Which makes no sense. I need to go run another errand, but I'm gonna take a few minutes and see if I can pull together this audit request. I'm very curious to find out what this was. Immediately, this is not ringing a bell, but I did just wanna pop in and say I had a great time and I'm home, but I need to go out and run an errand and then I'll be back and I think the most pressing thing, I need to just tackle this pile of receipts that I have in front of me from the weekend. Um, probably from the weekend and a couple of days last week, if I'm being honest. And then I do need to fold some towels. And then I feel like that's gonna be my night. 150 billion trillion percent. Do not feel like doing this right now. But if I don't start, I'm not gonna do it. It is 9.30, but it feels like midnight, which is also signaling to me that I just need some more rest. So folding the laundry today is not very pressing. I mean, honestly, even going through my receipts and updating my budget isn't really all that pressing, but I wanna start just because the more days that go by that I don't do it, the more days I have to make up for. The way that my body has just been in hibernation mode for the last couple of days, it's like there's no amount of sleep that's enough. Like I just keep waking up so unbelievably tired. My alarm went off for the gym this morning and I was just like, no, <laughs> no. I went right back to sleep and I still feel like I could sleep more. What is happening? I really am feeling like a bit of a mess already, but I went ahead and got myself some water, made a quick breakfast. This is one of those blueberry Osory rounds that I haven't tried yet. And I definitely have my hair products over here because um, I need to prep for this. What is that? I need to prep for this training session that I have this morning. 
I'm mainly going to be on the call just to kind of observe and make sure that this person is doing it right and be available for questions. So I can definitely be multitasking during that. I do have a couple of my own things I need to get out today, but during the beginning, I feel like they'll have the most questions. So I need to somewhat be alert and not be multitasking working, which is where my hair stuff comes in. I need to kind of just comb out this ponytail because it's looking. Also popping in here to give you an update on how this blueberry one tastes. So this is what the inside of it looks like. They definitely have blueberries in here, but it's giving actual bread. It's very, um, I don't think dense is the word, but it seems to be more bread than the regular Osiri rounds. And I feel like this one would be better with like cream cheese. It's still really good, but I think I like the original one better to eat plain. And this one I would definitely want to eat with cream cheese or peanut butter. But that's all for my taste test. I gotta go back to work, bye. <laughs> trying to get on the server and I can't. I need to pull this file and I've been sitting here trying to get on this thing for like 10 minutes. So I guess it's time for a snack. So this weekend I was talking to somebody about how hard it is to find like higher protein snacks. So I traded her a blueberry RX bar and she gave me this. It's the Quest cheese crackers. She said they're very much so like Cheez-Its. And for real, they look like Cheez-Its. I mean, let's be real here. There are 10 grams of protein in this bag. That's wild. Hold on a dang minute. These are very good. <laughs> the only problem I have with stuff like this is that protein snacks are expensive. Like. The bars that I like to eat are like between $2.50 and $3 regularly. So I can only imagine what the small little snack packs of this run, but it may be worth my time. So like I said, I'm still waiting on the server. So while I snack, I think I'm going to go ahead and get my towels out of the laundry and possibly just start folding them because I just feel like I don't want to waste time today. Like my energy is very much hit or miss for these past couple of days. And because I'm up and I got it, I feel like I should make use of it. The server's back up, so I need to get back to work. I actually don't know when I'm gonna have lunch today, which prompted this snack, because I have a meeting, like right now it's 1.12 and I have another meeting like, I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these meetings. I feel like I went from having like not a lot to meetings all the time and it is so stressful. But I have another one at 2.30 and it's 1.13 now. I let, I'm just gonna see how far I can get in 15 minutes. I think I can get that request put in and then maybe like two more things done in 15 minutes and then take a break because I need to sort out this box right here that is full of returns that need to be made. Let me stop bumping my gums and get back to work. Just waiting for my manager to sign in on this call and honestly, landscaping just will not let me live. I'm wondering if I have time to fix this one. This section back here was actually supposed to be two braids, but I was kind of sort of rushing, didn't realize that I had a meeting immediately after the first one. So I just panicked and made a big one. But I think I'm just about to split these up because I'm just sitting around here waiting for my manager. Which also means I definitely decided to not take my lunch break because I just didn't want to be rushing back to my desk to make this meeting on time. So right after this meeting wraps up, unless I have like an action item, I'm gonna take a break because I am very, very hungry. It's not my fault where I said he is directly to their backyard. Period. See everything. By going back into his like weekly report and finding his notes. Today's lunch for honestly Lena because it's almost four o'clock. Leftovers, baby. I have been a leftover queen as of late because 
I have not cooked a single thing that I've eaten this entire week and it's Thursday. So that says a lot. This is leftover General Tao's chicken. I ordered this the other day and I only ended up eating half because I just knew. Something in my soul knew that I was gonna need some leftovers to eat. I really should be wearing this. Yeah, girl, you should be wearing this. I just don't wanna get any red sauce on me, like 100%, just don't. I mean, all I need is just a little bit of green onion as a garnish, but I really don't need that because I don't have it and I'm not going to the store to get it. Anyways, do I need the light? Is it gonna? I mean, that's a little bit better, but not much. I'm about to take a full hour. I know it's almost four o'clock and I was trying to log off at five, but I'm gonna take my full lunch today, okay? I'm gonna eat my food, find something to watch on Netflix, which I don't know what I'm gonna watch because I started and finished Queen Charlotte all in one day. Sorrows, prayers. I wish there was more. That series was so fun to watch. But like I said, I'm gonna take my full hour and just figure out something. Like I thought I would be in the mood to sort through those returns, but I just feel like I need a minute to relax and not be doing something just to like sit down and mind my business. I'm in a bit of a mood this morning. I didn't sleep very well because one of my neighbors decided to start smoking weed in the middle of the night last night and it woke me up out of my sleep. decided I'm really not in the mood to make eggs in a breakfast round today for breakfast so I'm gonna try one of these things that I picked up the other week it's apple pie porridge by Wicked Foods here I had one last week I think and it was pretty decent um I still don't think that they'd be worth the money full price because I was looking at the ingredient list and I was like girl you can make that uh I do find myself a little bit short on time today and again I don't feel like cooking so I'm gonna try this out and see how it goes That doesn't look half bad. But is it actually good? That's the question that we want to answer. The ingredients in this one, it's oat flakes, sugar, barley flakes, soy protein, isolate, coconut extract, dried apples, maltodextrin, ground cinnamon, and natural flavor. It looks like good old oatmeal. Something isn't quite right. <laughs> it's okay, it's just not very flavorful. I'm gonna have some salt. I mean, that's better, but this one needs some tweaking. Maybe a little bit of maple syrup would help, but I ain't got time. I gotta go to work. What a morning it's been. That training was about to take me right on out of here. Oh, it looks kind of blown out. Um, I just felt like all the time that I spent last month was pretty much a waste because the person I was on the call with was almost acting like they had never seen the information before. So yeah, it took a lot for me to kind of just hold my peace. I did have another meeting, but it got canceled. So I'm just gonna take a few minutes and try to dig through these bags and make sense of some of these returns that I need to make. I was making that umbrella and when I tell you, I was just, buying things because I wasn't exactly sure what was gonna go good together. So there are a couple of rolls of like ribbon and whatnot that I can return to Hobby Lobby. I have like Hobby Lobby returns, Joann's, Target. I'm just gonna sit here for like 10 minutes and work on this and then I need to get back to my desk because I just looked at a project that I was assigned to do, like my portion that was split amongst our team and I have 536 checks that need to be cleared by Monday. 
so I need to get a start on that if I plan on having it done on time. Look here, I'm taking my work on the road. I have an appointment to get to and then I'm gonna go for a meal later. So I'm just gonna end the vlog here because I don't feel like anything I'm gonna do after that is gonna be of value. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so very much for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Hopefully with my voice back, bye. <laughs>